Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Esperanza. I am a full-time content creator living in Pittsburgh with my fiance and Labradoodle. There is a ton of construction going on in our neighborhood today, so hopefully that is not too distracting, but I have some packages here that I wanted to unbox for you guys. These packages, well, a couple of them are for my trip to Arizona, which I am leaving for tomorrow. So some clothing pieces I picked out specifically for this trip. And then I think I have maybe a couple of PR packages to unbox for you guys as well. So let's go ahead and get right into the haul. Okay, so this first package is a swimsuit. I'm not gonna show the label because my address is on there, but it's from Saturday Swimwear. So it is a swimsuit that I picked out for my Arizona trip. My parents have a pool, so I'm sure we're gonna spend at least some of the time at the pool. And the hotel that we're staying at in Tucson has a rooftop pool. So I think we'll also be spending some pool time there. So I definitely wanted a new swimsuit for this trip. So here is what the packaging looks like. Really simple pouch, love that. Kind of has like a linen look to it. And the swimsuit, those colors look so good together. But the swimsuit is this really pretty, kind of like rusty orangey brown color. I love the label too, Saturday swimwear. So this is a sustainably made swimsuit. Um, I really have been trying my best to support more sustainable brands and to basically just stock my closet with more sustainable clothing. I've gotten rid of most of my fast fashion pieces, so I'm really excited to be able to curate my closet with sustainable pieces that are better for the environment. As you guys know, I also do a ton of thrifting on my channel as well. So basically the swimsuit top is kind of like a little tank top. And then here are the bottoms. They have a cute little label on the back. So it's a little two-piece set. I love this color and I have a really pretty macrame cover-up that I thrifted that I want to style over it. Let me show that to you guys actually really quickly. So here is that macrame slip and that combined with this really pretty rusty orange color is going to be so cute. Very Arizona as well. So I'm very excited to hopefully get a few photos in this look. So just a little bit more about the brand. They are actually women owned, sustainable, ethical, and handmade in the USA. So that is Saturday swimwear. <laughs> So this next package is from the brand Unpublished Denim. I picked out a few pants and tops, I believe. So let's go ahead and open this up. Okay, so I have three pieces here. Let's go ahead and start off with this pair of brown pants. Okay, so I will have to try these on, but I was very careful about looking at the dimensions on the size guide. My fiance Skyler helped me too because I do have really short legs, but kind of like a bigger booty. So it can be kind of hard to find pants that fit. So these hopefully will fit pretty well because I double checked all the measurements and had help doing it. So I'm hoping these will fit my short legs, but they are kind of this wide leg um, that I really like, kind of like a 70s feel to them. And here's the pockets, kind of a cute little detail. So these are made from 100% cotton. I like the little wood buttons too, super cute. And it's just like this really warm, rich brown color, similar color to the swimsuit, a little bit more on the brown side. And I think these will be so cute for the tops that I'm planning on styling. But I think these are going to be so cute in Arizona with like the desert backgrounds, cacti, that kind of thing. And then I also got the same pair of, of pants, but in this green color. I can't remember what the color names were. So they're both the Gemma style, the Mod Sailor Gemma. And, um, 
I can't remember what the color names were, but I'll try to link these in the description below. So the green pair kind of has a different button style in the front. Very cute. They also have like these pocket details on the front wide leg bottom with the cuff. So I think these are gonna be so cute for Arizona. These are just gonna be so perfect for like that desert background. And then let's see here. I also have a top. So this is a cropped button up shirt. I love this like collar look. And the cropped shirt, I think, looks really flattering with these types of pants that have like a higher waist. So the cutoff should just hit like right above the pants, which I really like that style together. I think it's just a little bit more flattering for my body type. That just seems to be like what I usually gravitate towards. And it's nice because you can get like a little bit of a breeze. I like that this top also has kind of a linen look to it almost and I like that it's more of like a creamy white as opposed to like a really bright like cool white I think that that looks so cute and then the last item from unpublished denim is this jumpsuit here so kind of a linen look but it is actually 100% cotton i believe and it has short sleeves which will be nice because it does get very hot in arizona i love the collar top and then they are pants with a little bit of a wider leg to them so just a really cute jumpsuit i always love the look of a jumpsuit um styled with like a hat and some like ankle boots they're always just super easy to style and always look really classic. So I thought that would be super cute for the Arizona desert. Um, oh, we've got these nice pockets too in the front. They actually have these really cute pockets in the back, pockets in the front, buttons down the front. Needs a little bit of an iron. So I'll have to try these on and make sure that they are not too long, but if they are, I can just have like my mom or sister um, hem them for me. So we'll see. I have a few more things I want to show you guys. Okay guys, so here is what the top looks like. It's a super cute button up top. I love the cropped fit of it. The collar is super cute too. And it's kind of a loose fitting shirt with like a linen look looks so cute with the green pants. These are like a little bit, just a little bit above the belly and they actually are the perfect length for me. I was worried because I do have such short legs, but I think that these are the perfect length and should still look good with ankle boots. Okay, so here is the brown pair now with some ankle boots. These are from April and they still look super cute with ankle boots as well. I think they are pretty much the perfect length for me. So I'm so happy about that. So I am just thrilled about that. I've been wanting a pair of pants like these for quite some time now, and now I have two fun colors to play with. And here is the jumpsuit. It's also the perfect length. I love the color of it. It's a little bit more loose, which is nice because then that'll be just all the more comfortable. I love the pockets in the front. Got some pockets here as well and pockets on the back. So just a really cute little jumpsuit, which should look super cute with like a hat styled with it and it's just a very casual classic look okay so here is what the swimsuit looks like it's actually super comfortable i love the fit of it it almost looks like kind of like a little sports bra tank top almost and then the bottoms are super comfortable and stretchy as well and they still cover a very nice amount of the booty area i think i actually had selected these in a slightly higher fit but um these are the ones that were sent 
might have been my bad not sure but it still looks like super cute i just would have wanted a slightly higher rise on the swimsuit bottom just because that's what i prefer and then here is what the little macrame swimsuit cover up looks like with this i think that looks super cute so it's super boho. I'm so glad that I found this at the Goodwill bins. I think it's going to be super cute for some poolside photos at my parents' house. I was actually really worried that these packages weren't going to arrive in time for my trip tomorrow. I'm still waiting for one more package that a brand was sending. So hopefully that does arrive today. And if it does, I will be able to include that in this video. So fingers crossed. But I do have a PR package from Pop Beauty here that I wanted to open up for you guys. So Pop Beauty is a clean, cruelty-free skincare and makeup brand. They sent this set of four products here. The first is a headband. The second is a cleanser, their Fizz Jelly Cleanser. Um, we have a pom-pom peel here and then the Jet Setter Anti-Fatigue Mask here. So a fun little set for some self-care. I'm definitely gonna have to try this out tonight because I need to get my skin in shape before my flight and upcoming trip tomorrow. <music> Okay guys, so that last package I was waiting for arrived on time, so I'm going to go ahead and unbox this for you guys really quickly. This is from the brand Abel, which is a Nashville-based brand. So I picked out a few spring dresses, a couple pairs of shoes, and a really cute bag. Okay, so the first dress is a sunshine yellow, kind of a T-length dress. It has a really pretty neckline here. It's a little bit more of a like loose flowy dress. We have these loose quarter sleeves and pretty long and flowy at the bottom, T-length style. Couple of buttons here in the front. I love the colors and this crossbody leather purse actually complements the colors in that dress super well. The ankle boots I picked out also complement the dress super well as well. They are kind of a suede, um, I believe the color was cognac, kind of a warm rusty red color. I love the wood bottom heels and I love that these have a low heel to them. I didn't, I don't have a ton of ankle boots with this um, height on the ankle boots, which is a little bit easier to walk in. Most of mine are kind of a larger heel, but I wanted some that would be easier to walk around in. So I'm super excited about these. I also picked out this dress. I'm not sure what this style is called, um, but it's super flattering, kind of a scrunchy chest area. It's really flattering fit here loose sleeves that are full length sleeves and this is also a t-length style dress super comfy kind of a fun detail here with a little tie and it's another floral type pattern dress and the last thing i picked up from abel are these pair of white tennies i love the brown toe on these they're just super neutral and should go really well with the rest of my wardrobe for arizona and another comfy shoe option for walking around in okay guys sorry if you can hear the construction but here is what the dress looks like on this is a size small. I do like where it hits on my legs as far as the length, but the top is a little big. Be nice if this was like somehow just a little bit tighter in the back. Maybe my mom or sister might be able to help me with that. But overall, I'd rather it was a little bit more loose and comfortable. And I do like the length of it. Super cute dress for Arizona and just like spring in general. And then here are what those ankle boots look like. I really needed a pair like this with a lower heel so that I could walk around a little bit easier and I don't have a ton of ankle boots like that actually. So I'm very excited about those. And then here's what the pink dress looks like styled with the white tennies and this really cute crossbody leather purse. I love the 
style of the top and it also is super flattering here on the waist and a nice length as well. Okay guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. I was so glad I was able to film this before my trip. I was worried that the packages weren't going to arrive in time for my Arizona trip, so I'm so glad that they did. So I'll have some cute outfits to style for my Arizona content. I think I'm also gonna film another vlog after this. I have some plants I want to repot and then also just kind of show you guys what I'm planning on bringing to Arizona, other outfits I'm thinking of packing, just more of like a casual vlog type video. So definitely keep your eyes peeled for that one, which will go up shortly after this video. And I will actually be in Arizona when these videos go up. I'm really excited about this trip. My parents retired in Phoenix, but we've never actually gone and like explored in Phoenix. So we're going to be doing that. And we're also going to be exploring Tucson, which is like an hour and a half outside of Phoenix. We're going to be staying there for a night. And my sister is also coming up from LA. So it should be a really fun trip. Creating and sharing a ton ton of Arizona content on all of my social media channels so be sure to follow me along at The Urban Darling and check out my blog theurbandarling.com where I'll be sharing lots of Arizona travel guides as well. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate your support and if you guys know of anyone else that would enjoy this channel as well please be sure to share it with them so you guys can help me grow my channel and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.